Hi everyone, welcome to another 31 day challenge video day. In today's video, as you can tell by the title down below, I will be repainting the Four Seasons painting that I did last year. And if you guys don't know what it is, there's half of it. <laughs> I will be also showing it in the video. But I did this painting where I had these little panels and in each panel there was a different season. Like this is winter, uh, this is fall and then I believe this is spring because there's a lot of flowers there and then this is summer and so I don't remember which one is which but one of them is spring or summer they just both look alike but anyways I wanted to kind of repaint them because I feel like in my last 31 day challenge which I did a year ago I did not do my best on this and I feel like I could add a lot more detail into this so I am kind of repainting it and kind of making it look better than it was so hopefully I do a good job of this and if you like this video give it a like because why not <laughs> but I did these I did break them down into four parts so there were four videos to these and I will be making this one into a whole video since I am repainting all these panels and like making it look better so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to give it a like and let's just get on with the video hello and welcome to the voiceover portion of this so I ended up starting with the winter panel because I felt like that would be the easiest. There was like a, I don't know, scuff from a green marker. I don't know how it got on there, so I quickly fixed that. And then I went on with this navy blue color and kind of covered up the mess that I was trying to make a river, which did not work out. And I looked up some pictures of like actual rivers that were frozen and I followed from that way and it looked a lot better than before and I feel like I did a good job fixing that and I think that was about it of what I fixed on the winter panel was just the river and then the little green marker scuff that was on there and that was about it and then I went on to painting the water or the river on the spring and summer panel and also fixing the sky on I think that's the spring panel the one with the roof and then the fall to as well because I had it just orange in the background and you know I needed a sky for that one or else it just it would look weird and then I went back to working on the river I did a lot of research on how to paint rivers and I feel like I did a much much better job than the first time around when I first started this like four season painting and I feel like it looks a lot more realistic than it did before so I'm very proud of myself for this and of course it has to be a lot more different than the winter side because on the like the winter panel the water is frozen and so I had to make the water a lot darker on the winter panel and then on the spring and summer panel there were just like it was a lighter blue and so that is what I did and I feel like this looks 10 times better than the first time I painted this so I'm really glad I was able to redo this I feel like I did a much better job one thing I would change about it is probably the roof you will kind of see that it, it doesn't look the greatest but I still feel like it looked a lot better than how it used to be. Yeah, I hope you guys liked this little redo. I did this video last year for my 31 day challenge. I pretty much did this four season painting. It was in four parts because it would take me a while to do it in just one video. Plus again, I was doing the uh, 31 day challenge like I am right now. But for this one, I thought, you know what, I'm just going to make it one video because I'm just fixing up some bits and pieces here and there. It's not like I'm repainting the whole thing. Like I already have, you know, the image and whatnot. That is what I did. And like I said, I feel like all my videos from last year, 2018. I do have a playlist, by the way, if you guys want to go check it out. Uh, it's it's on my YouTube channel. Just look for the 31 Day Challenge 2018, and you will see my videos there. But I feel like for this year. I did a lot better in video quality than last year so I'm very proud of myself and the videos that I've put out. Of course there's some videos here and there that aren't the greatest but you know trying to upload for 31 days for a whole month and trying to edit all of those 
videos while also working on videos for February and March because I tend to work on videos kind of ahead of schedule just so just in case of any emergency comes up I still have some video content going out to you guys so it's been a process but I got through we're almost there to finishing this 31 day challenge so thank you for everyone who's been watching my videos every single day I know it could be tiring seeing or hearing me every single day <laughs> talking but I still hope you guys enjoyed this little challenge every day and yeah I feel like I did a very very good job especially on the fall panel because the fall panel is just all yellow and orange and just I think that was my least favorite one out of all of them and so I feel like I did a much better job this time around with it and of course like I even painted the mountains bright orange and yellow that just did not match like mountains aren't orange <laughs> I ended up just kind of going with an old style of like a rocky not an old style like more of a rocky type of mountains in the background I mean mountains do have trees and whatnot but they are in the far distance to where you can't really see those trees so I just kind of went with you know some grays and I used different shades of grays just so it's kind of more noticeable to how you know mountains are supposed to be <laughs> and of course I ended up changing the tree as well the color because the way I painted the tree it was just horrible like it does not look like a tree so I ended up just painting it a dark color and then going over with some light shades to make it more wood like and not look like the tree has acne because <laughs> that's literally how it looks like so I changed that up and I'm honestly like I'm happy with myself with this second time around and like you saw in the beginning of the video like you saw them how it looked before <laughs> and of course like the thumbnail as well you will see it because I will add the before and then of course the after will be blurred because it'll be this amazing art piece that you will see in the end of this video <laughs> and a little bit of a promotion for myself um I have an Etsy shop where I sell buttons if you want some buttons I have a link down below and I have a red bubble shop as well if you want some stuff that'll make me happy that will help support my channel and thank you to everyone who has bought some buttons from me it makes me really happy knowing you guys actually like my art on buttons and yeah like thank you so much and also for my red bubble shop as well and for supporting this channel like slowly but surely I am growing I am getting there and that's all because of you guys so thank you thank you so much I love all of you guys hopefully I will be able to learn from editing mistakes, from, you know, drawing mistakes, and I'll get better at that. But for now, it is what it is. But again, I hope you guys have a lovely day. And I don't know, I'm just trying to extend this voiceover because the video is almost over. And I just, I like to record a full voiceover, I've noticed, instead of having bits and pieces there because I feel like it's not the greatest. But, you know, but I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Always stay smiling smile at people that you walk past by because why not that will make their day and thank you guys so much for watching my videos it means so much and i will see you in tomorrow's video